Yo guys, what is going on here? It is your boy from the land and I'm the Jetman and I'm bringing you a brand new LDL All Stars video. Don't know what week it is, don't know what battle it is, just know that Squid asked me to record his battle against against Lazy Ghost. Two formidable opponents. And in the left corner we have the one, the only the cooked calamari. The bison squid, ladies and gentlemen. And in the right corner, we have undisputed, undenied threat in the LDL Draft League. The man that has more belts than Christian Grey, Lazy Ghost. Woo, woo, woo. Actually, to realize, Squid's intro was under was under hyped. Let's go back to Squid. This man just won PCL D League. This man is a threat. When PGL, this man is coming for your wife. So, ladies, I said, gentlemen, watch out. But with that being said, let's get into this match and let's see how this went down. I'm not sure. I'm not. I'm not sure if these two faced in the regular season. If they did it. It's even better. It's more hype. Cannot wait for this. So we already know that Squid left. Squid led Zerora. Lazy led Inferno. So let's see how let's see how, let's see how this match goes. Chuck that there so I can look 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 like I'm looking at the camera. It's a bit laggy. Okay. The knockoff turn one. Knockoff turn one. Going for a special variant. Oof. Now to, now to see if Mock Punch. To see if Mock Punch can kill. Alright, swaps out, swaps out in case, swaps out in case. Good swaps, good swaps, good, good swap. This is 38 turns. Yep, there's the Mock Punch. See, Lazy's just predictable now. Lazy, Lazy's just predictable. Swaps out, of course, yeah. My other tick, yeah. With our Mother Tick Orlando. There. My last second percentage is doing 40% out. Okay. Gets the lefties, gets the lefties. Are you good again? Okay. Do you have a death wish or, or, or something? Is he gonna, or, or is he going to predict the wish? All the toxic, there we go. Now Malatik has nothing. Mal Malatik has nothing next turn, actually. Minus minus two speed squid. Yeah, could be in trouble here. Could be in trouble. Minus two speed. But I think he'd rather the poison than a scold. Withdraws a Malatik, okay. So squid stays in. So squid stays in here. He must be a choice scarping team here, that's why. Must be a choice scarf, Big Dini. Is that choice banned? Like, what? The damage on that. Jesus. Okay. Uh. That's caught me off my guard. Okay. Uh, so, Squid has slept out here because. Kid Flash has done, has done its job. Kid Flash has done its job. Taking out Inferno. Taking out one of Marty's or one of uh, one of one of Lazy's rockers. U turn, I'll play it. And he goes into the Gardevoir here. Yep. And is he a calm mind or wish? That's the question. Is he a calm mind or wish? Is he a calm mind or wish? I'll play, get the intimidate. Does he go calm mind or wish? And if so, does he does he have baton pass? Could he mellow swaps out? Yep, as you would predict normally. Oof. When the teeny, it just V create. Nothing standing in the way of V create. Honestly, nothing is standing in the way. 
My other tiki's down to low health. Yep, there's the wish. There's the wish. Now does he go baton pass? Or just... Cause he, cause he can't straight out swap. He straight out swaps. Ah, uh, Porygon, there we go. Forgot about Mr. Mr. Pori, Mr. Pori. Hmm. Squid. Choice band, choice band had to be an EV light. Squid with these plays. Ladies and gentlemen, this is why Blazing Squid should not go. This way should not fall under the radar, honestly. This is why. This man plays hard. Yep. Another finds a choice band here. Special programs, it doesn't matter anyway. No hacks there, no hacks there, no hacks there, but. No far. Squid has, up, Squid has the upper hand here. Squid has the upper hand here. Oh, is he going to let him go for a knockoff or a drain punch? Toxic. Okay, so there's no swap out to Gardevoir there. Hmm. So my question here is... <sighs> Does the Gardevoir have heal bell? That is the question. Because if Gardevoir has heal bell, Porygon 2. Doesn't need it. He's a stall scrafty. He's a stall scrafty. Ladies and gentlemen, we have seen it all. We have seen it all. We have a toxic stalling scrafty. Don't know why he does not have Grand Punch here. Does he have Grand Punch? Does he have Grand Punch? Or is he going for a bulk up Grand Punch? Squid, he's obviously shown he's not going to swap it out. But it's choice banded, so it's not so it's not useful to him at all, other than a sack. So he's gonna wait till it's low health to to swap out, or he's just gonna sack it. Simple as that. So you better get your drain punch off before he loses. Squid. <laughs> Porygon isn't useful to him with a choice band, and with and without an Eevee light, it is not a wall anymore. So he's just gonna sack it. And. Uh, like I said before, he's gonna sack it until uh, until he's gonna leave it as a sack. Thank you, Squid. I know it was just a toxic, 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 but you did what needed to be done. You did what needed to be done. Lazy was always gonna use that as a as a mon two sack in the future, as soon as it was choice banded, uh, poisoned, hundred percent. Put him come back, yep. Prediction. The voice. It's a speed tie. He is currently a speed tie. Who does he have? He has Lando. <sighs> he has he, he has Lando to take a hit, that's it. He's Lando to take a hit, that's it. Lando to take a hit, that's it. But does he go? Good sack, good sack, good sack, good sack. Because if, if he goes for the trick here, well played, Squid. Well played. Well played. Poison will take it out. Down goes Porygon. So it's a four. So it's a six-four lead to Squid right now. Six-four lead to Squid. Squid, mate, coming with the coming with the power. Coming out with straight hot fire. Does he go for? Oh, so he's going for the hurricane. So, so he's going for the hurricane here. If Lazy has mirror coat, that'll be amazing. If Lazy has mirror coat, that'll be amazing. Good scouting, Squid. Good scouting. Why not run Thunder? Pretty, I'm pretty sure. Does Gardevoir get Thunder? If it does, why not run it against a Pidgeot? Squid, well played, well played, well played. Who does he, who, he, does he go into Zero Aura here? Does he go into Zero Aura? Squid. Zero Aura. Volt Absorb. What are you doing? 
You save Victini. Squid. You save Victini and... Squid. If you lose, I'm blaming you for that turn. I'm blaming you for that turn, honestly. Blaming you for that turn. That was silly. You have the Inferno down. Squid. What are you doing? You're playing so well up until that point. Well, apart from the constantly toxic mellow, but... At least he was smart. He would have seen that Squid was just going to toxic, 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 so he wouldn't have swapped into the Gardevoir. That goes the Hurricane, then goes Gardevoir. That comes Greninja. Greninja has to be by one base link. By one base point, so. When the room comes out, it goes into Beauty, that would go to Vaporeon. New turn, well played. And he did his he go into the Milo Tick. Yep, Milo Tick. He can go for a recover here. He has Milo Scale. Yep, they're both they're both pretty running the stall they're probably both running their respective stall sets. So Squid will go for a toxic here. So Squid ran Toxic on Teeny, Mallow, so if you had it gone with Gardevoir, you'd be full health, and the land has to come in, hit and paralyze, or just swap out into the Victini that you killed anyway, because Mallow would, would be at full health, and now your Zero Aura goes down or gets burned. Sea squid. <sighs> yep, down goes the hurricane. Takes on the Malatic. Can Greninja, does Greninja have to U turn or Ice Beam here? He's gonna scout, he's gonna scout. Wild well played, good, well played, well played, good scout, good scout, good scout. Dark Pulse. Okay. If it's Dark Pulse, Squid's not worried unless we go for U turn here. Squid, if you had it, did what I said against the Gardevoir, your Zero Aura would still be alive to handle this Greninja. But lucky that you have S Cavalier. Knock off. Knocking off, that's knocking off the uh, Choice Scarf. Ah, okay. Hmm. So Lazy has Landers left and Gardevoir. Land no, Landers left. That's it. Just just Lando. So how does this last another eight turns? Honestly, how does this last an another eight turns? Differential doesn't matter. I'm pretty sure. Pretty Bellow gets off the Intimidate. Well played. Well played. That's fair. That's fair. That is fair. Squid. That is fair. But. Never mind then. If he goes rock polish here, if he goes rock polish here, I think he can use a Z. If he goes rock polish here, <laughs> told you, lazy, lazy, lazy to me is predictable now, because I've just faced him that many times and he's starting to get predictable. Does he come back and clutch this? That's my question. Does he come? Back, does he have the Z? No, he doesn't need Z. Oh, he's running love me. 
he doesn't need and because of, and because of no guard Pidgeot. Oof, smart. Nothing's taking it. It's, it's, it's a plus one fly. It is a plus one fly. No, he just goes to fly again next turn. Dan goes, oh, this could be a comeback. And that's why it's four turns left. Four turns left. Does the earthquake take the vapor and down? Well played, Squid. Well played, well played, well played, well played, well played. He still has enough to in, in the tank to be able to take him down. He has the Mallow, he has the Scrafty and the Pidgeot left. If he's running Stone Edge, A, take the Pidgeot down. And all, and all he's to do is just, is just go fly the next turn after. He's, he's still has a chance to win. Rock Polish. He's not running Stone Age? Okay, okay, so he's just going for the fly. So he's just going for the fly. So he's just going for the fly. Why isn't this working? So he's just going for the fly. Oh, it, 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 it just stopped. Hang on. Oh, you're kidding me. You are kidding me. It stopped recording at the most pivotal moment. Give me a second to fix that, and then I'm going to... Give me a second to fix that, and then I'm and then I'm gonna re replay those last few turns. Oh my god, this what? One of the. Uh, where is it? Yeah, it's this. So why isn't it working? Why aren't you working? Honestly, you bitch. Oh, don't, don't tell me it's changed for that. Don't tell me it's changed for that. It has, it has, it has, hasn't it? What are you doing? No, no, no. Oh, you're kidding me, Hanky. You're kidding me. You're kidding me. <laughs> so basically, what you last saw was the Lando go for a polish, fly into the Pidgeot, I can't remember if you're because I was too busy focusing on too busy focusing on this. Why does the DS have to play up now? Why does it have to play up now? It's, it's at 119. So why is it not working? Oh, you prick. Oh my god. So hang on. Give me a second to get back up to these turns. We'll go to turn 36 and I will describe what's happening. So turn 36. This should be from where we left off. Don't know why this, don't, don't know why it's it just started to stop working all, all, all of a sudden for some reason. No clue why I could not tell you and it's bullshit. Just my luck today, because I've had shit luck today with Pokemon, so. It is what it is, I guess. Uh, gotta love Pokemon, don't you? Okay, so the Vaporeon is in with the Lando. Lando goes for the Earthquake. Takes down the Vaporeon, turn 36. That's what you last saw. Ingram comes in. And he goes for the, goes for the Hurricane, yep. 
place for the rock polish. 1037, but 1038, he goes for fly. Landris just fainted. Lando with a flight and then Lando fainted. So I don't know what happened at the end of that. A squid will have to tell you in the recap of it all, but yeah, but it said Lando fainted, so I'm going to assume it's squid one. So with that being said, guys, uh, congratulations to squid. But I hope, but I hope you enjoyed the All Star months, not weekend. But yeah, hope you, hope you enjoyed it and. Looking forward to doing it next season. So with that being said, this has been your boy from Land Down Under. Get my name on it. Signing off and peace.